A little under a year ago, for the first time in the race's near five decades of existence, the Governor's Cup was canceled as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. Now, as we're getting ready for the 2021 Governor's Cup, the race's director announced that they're going to be holding three in-person races, a full marathon, a half marathon, and a 5K race. Brian Haynes, the race's director, says they're heading in the right direction to finally hold these in-person events, and everyone seems to be excited. There's a lot of excitement, you know, for a return of running events for a return of events in general and just kind of a return to a bit of normalcy and you know we've had a lot of positive feedback with our announcement a lot of encouragement and to a lot of understanding that um yes we we are planning to be in person but it's not going to be um your typical governor's cup the half and full marathon entries will be capped at 375 for each event and 1,200 in the 5K race with three flights of 400 people. Anyone affiliated with the race must wear a mask, with the runners being the lone exception being able to take off their mask while they're running. But even despite the changes, many runners are just itching to compete, including Gov Cup runner of nearly two decades, Mike Kaiser. Everybody wants this to be a safe event, and I, th I don't think it'll diminish the excitement at all. I think you're going to have a lot of runners out there that are just excited to be out there competing again, um, being able to see their competition and being able to challenge themselves. Spectators being asked to not crowd the race specifically at the start and finish, which is a bit of a bummer in multi-time Governor's Cup race winner Heather Lieberg's words, but she hopes with the reintroduction of in-person races, it also opens the door for other races to start up in person as well. I always see people along the course that kind of keeps you motivated, but um, I think, Without them, it's going to be rough, but it will still be an opportunity to race. And hopefully this is a start of many more races to come in the near future. Races for the 2021 Governor's Cup start on June 12th at 6 a.m. That's the full marathon just south of Jefferson City and ends right here at Anchor Park in Helena. For MTN Sports, I'm Sam Hoyle.